man said well i will draw it oh but i know you are wasting your time no and he will draw it and write it there or some persons will spell their goals in the name of jesus by the end of 2023 i should be worth at least 10 million naira may not be too much at whatever level someone may laugh at you and say just that no problem allow them you just keep dreaming with god in the name of jesus as a man of god i should have the privilege at the end of the year i should be serving his grace to these people and this region planning is powerful and there is no planning without deploying your imagination listen i want you to respect what you are hearing believe me even from an intellectual standpoint you will not hear what you are hearing without paying a price i assure you on this ask any consultant and any intelligent person what you are hearing for free is what people will pay tens of thousands of dollars to travel for seminars to listen to i pray and hope that you respect it lesson number two from an overcomer is that when there is no definition to your desires there is no sustainable success let's rush are we learning lesson number three are you ready people are not really affected by what happens to them listen and then you write people are not really affected by what happens to them they are affected by the meaning they give what happens to them it is not what happens to people that affects them it is the definition and the meaning they give what affects what happens to them that causes the pain and the despair let me say it again and then i will i will dictate it for you to write people are not really affected by what happens to them they are affected by the meaning and the definitions and also the interpretations that they tie to what happens to them please look up don't worry you will write what is the difference between falling in church and falling in a restaurant young lady as i'm teaching right now if the power of god carries you up and lands you down you get up rejoicing and even your seat may say my god he has visited you versus you fall down in a restaurant you fell down you the worst fall may even be here what is the difference it's not the falling down is the meaning that you attach to that experience that's what causes depression that's what causes joy it is never what happens to you that has that power to destroy you you have associated happenings around your life and you have connected them to certain meanings there are events that mean failure to you there are events that mean weakness to you there are events that mean oppression to you what is making someone cry is another person's desire someone will cry and say i got only one million is a meaning you connected to it that based on your level one million is a testimony of a failure whereas for someone that one million he would talk about it as though i mean he just got to heaven now you write please people are not affected by what happens to them they are affected by the meaning they connect to the happenings people are not really affected by what happens to them they are affected by the meaning that they connect to those happenings this is the reason why comfort and counseling is powerful what happens when you are comforted what happens when you are being counseled your perceptions are being changed that's all the situation is not being solved necessarily it is your perception for instance if you lose a loved one because of the pain or let's let me use something more more bearable you lose a job and you get angry and angry and someone sits with you down and says do you know perhaps the bible says all things work together for good is that true watch what is happening to you now the person says i know the story of someone who lost a job and did not know it was a springboard to the next level at the end of it the person who was crying 10 minutes ago is now suddenly rejoicing did you give the person a job no you change the meaning associated to that situation can i tell you when you learn this principle you can laugh through storms what happens when you make a video 
and you have only two likes or two follows why do you cry Abba, all of this can you imagine I suffer to preach this message and only two people are you sure it was only two people what if the first click was a congregation listening to you but you have asso there is a meaning people are not really affected by what happens I assure you why do you hate to let people know that your father with all due respect maybe is some person doing some menial job and you lie and call him your uncle no that's my uncle my real father is abroad why are you telling that lie it's not necessarily because you're a bad person there is a meaning you feel that when you reveal the true status of your father in that lowly estate it may affect people's perception about your self-worth and you will lose your sense of significance that means a secured believer is one who redefines the meaning that you have associated to many things and with many things in your life hallelujah are you learning it is truly not what happens to you that destroys you i mean you just called me joshua selman not apostle josh do you know who i am what is the meaning of that perhaps maybe from that culture they feel it's okay to just say joshua selman and you are saying me you will soon know now that god called me <laughs> all that complaint is simply because apostle was missing no it is a meaning you have connected to it there are people who are so insecure that even if it's a little child that taps your leg and says uncle they will slap him because they are used to respect how dare you tap my feet this little boy and they slap the boy and say you don't know who i am why will a man pound on his wife slapping her and saying do you know i'm older than you it should be obvious why would the woman revenge back and say you you will you will you will stay without food this night and all that drama is happening do you know at the end of it is simply that there is a, an oscillation they are stinging their ego and simply because of the meaning meaning lessons from an overcomer number three we are not really affected by what happens to us it is the definition and the meaning that we associate so because of this meaning and definitions another word for it is called ego ego is an industry there are businesses that are literally built out of this deficiency in men are we together yes if you watch me and i come down from a car and it's a nice jeep or some lincoln navigator or something like, that's right but if i come out from maybe a golf or somewhere you now say no 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 now is this should not be there are people who stand behind aircrafts they have never entered and may never enter soon and snap in front of it and just say to god be the glory i just arrived what no, i'm not i'm not trying to be sarcastic i'm not trying to be sarcastic all right but why do we go through this pressure why do we go through all of those kinds of things that house you see is my own in fact uh, i don't want to say much and then we wrap up everything and just say to god be the glory but the truth is that we hope that by some meaning even if it is by falsehood we will earn respect are we together people will believe that oh we are serious people maybe we are wealthy and so on and so forth can i tell you when you learn to give things proper meanings offense will be minimized in your life the direct consequence of violating this principle is that you will live a life in unnecessary pain and offense someone can be looking at you and thinking about his rent and you will think the person is eyeing you i've noticed that this person is eyeing